two sides not really in the best of form come head to head at the Crown Oil Arena today. Rochdale have mustered just one win in their last eight matches in all competitions. That dates back to the middle of November. Bradford have just two victories in their last 13 outings. That said, those two victories for Bradford have both been in the league both this month. Rochdale in their defence have only played once since before Christmas. Perhaps today though will start something special. Bradford that won 2-0 at home in October. Last time they did the double against today's opposition, the 1980-81 season. Here's a chance for Walker and the visitors. It's a decent dipping shot, took a deflection as well. He didn't need asking twice, three or four blue shirts in front of him. Still got his shot away. It's an early promise. Two wins in the last 13 appearances in all competitions, two in ten. That's the record of the Bantams and the Derek Adams. Give the ball away here though, a little bit of sloppy play. Opportunity for the hosts. That's a really good bit of goalkeeping though. Smart save. Grant it was with the shot. Hornby with the save. Oh, really opening first seven or eight minutes of this match. Given away in the midfield, Rochdale get the ball forward really, really quickly. Grant reacts, first time shot. That's a really good bit of goalkeeping from Hornby. And when the ball came back in, the chance was gone. Opportunity for Bradford, opportunity for Rochdale. That's another dipping effort. And Walker it is again. Two shots on goal he's had, that was a little bit further wide. Four wins in the last 22 games in all competitions for today's hosts. Really stop Dale's Dale. Need to do a little bit more to get themselves up the table. Starting the day in 18th place, but they're on the attack here. Here's Odo. Opportunity here, he just can't get his shot away. Good, brave goalkeeping and defending. Good communication between Hornby and his defence. Just kind of got stuck under his feet, didn't it? So between Bradford and Rochdale. They tend to travel here quite well. Grant. For Dale. Had a decent effort in that first half. Broadbent. That's a nice shot just wide of the goalkeeper's upright. And the right wing back doesn't need opportunities to get forward. Don't need asking twice. out newbie from the colour of his hair here he is the Rochdale man the substitute putting himself about here they come again in the form of Dooley the ball into the box required there's newbie and he's had two opportunities in what 30 seconds newbie here's the first one gets between the defenders Nice little touch, can't steer the ball wide of the goalkeeper though. He's been earning his money today, he's made a couple of decent stops. Long punt forward, runs his side the free kick. Cook it is who won it. Walker's around this one, as is Cook. It's going to be Walker that fizzes a drive in. Coleman right behind it though. Sort of distance, it does have to be something special, doesn't it, to be a keeper? I don't know. For Rochdale, license to run. Broadbent. Newbie. And again, he's Broadbent. This is good from Rochdale. 
just need the shot on goal. Brave defending, really good defending in actual fact. Clark it was with it, the substitute, I fancy, on that far side. It was nicely moved on by Dooley. And there was Clark, actually came off his own man look once, almost twice. from Dale. Newby lurking. Now an opportunity maybe for Bradford to get away. Andrews is there. If he can just pull the trigger. Well he can't pull the trigger but he has pulled though by the looks of things. Is his hamstring. Angle running through. He had the pace to beat the defenders. It's a decent touch actually from Cook. Look at that, completely outstripping the defence. And then he feels it just as he hits the 18-yard box. Well, they haven't had the best of luck, Bradford, today. Injuries all over the pitch, substitutions. They haven't had the flow of the game, really. Neither side been able to get completely in their stride. Come again, though. Clark, decent looking ball towards Newby. Good bit of defending, and it needed to be. And hung the cross up really well. That's some terrific defending, you know. Is there some late drama? Is there going to be a late winner in this game? Forward looking for the ball. If Threlkold can get that ball into the box. He can't, but he's won his side a corner kick. It might be the target. There's Walker! Oh, that's almost six inches further to the goalkeeper's right, and I fancy that would have been the opening goal. See him lurking on the edge of the box there, took his time, took a touch. That's a really good strike, actually. It's a fine save from Coleman. switches it beautifully. It's well read in actual fact. Right, wins a free kick, dangerous position. Added time at the end of this game. This could be danger for Bradford. Newby. Five in the wall. He scores here, he wins it. Oh! What a shot! And what a save! Hornby keeps his team in it. Brilliant bit of goalkeeping from a fine free kick. Bent forward. It's a little bit desperate now. Both sides looking to win it. Can they just repel this last attack, Rochdale? They can. And that is the full time whistle. In the end, no goals. Plenty of opportunities, plenty of chances. Neither side really doing enough on the day, though. Back to back games without scoring for Rochdale. Still yet to score, in fact, in 2022. Bradford two wins and a draw from the opening four league games of the year. It's ended Rochdale nil, Bradford City nil.